hello again, viewers. We all know that the food we eat often provides us with essential nutrients. In this video, we're going to talk about the six basic nutrients that you can get from food and their functions. Let's get started with the nutrient which dominates more than 60% of our body. Water Even if you decide to go on a diet and not eat any more proper meals, you can still survive, although you won't make it without water. For every organ of your body to work properly, it needs water. This liquid helps your brain function and cleanses your body of toxins. The cells in your body stay hydrated because of water. Apart from that, water also helps in the process of digestion. If you're someone who doesn't drink water regularly, you might find yourself constipated more often than not. If you aren't drinking water properly, you'll end up becoming dehydrated. That's not good for your body as it can affect its mental and physical performance. Not drinking enough water can also make you feel tired and reduce your ability to concentrate. Vitamins The basic function of these nutrients is to keep away diseases and keep you healthy. Without a healthy dose of vitamins, it would be difficult for your body to fight microorganisms. While there are about 13 types of vitamins that your body needs, four of them are extremely essential. These are vitamin A, B6, C, and D. These four vitamins play an important role in your body. In case you aren't getting enough of these vitamins, you might face some problems. For example, lack of vitamin B6 can cause your blood pressure to lower uncontrollably. Similarly, lack of other vitamins may cause skin problems, vision problems, and weakness. On the other hand, Having enough vitamins in your body would mean that you'll have a healthy immune system. The risks of getting lung and prostate cancer would also reduce with the proper intake of vitamins. Additionally, vitamins also have high levels of antioxidant properties that are good for your body. What's more, it's been found that vitamins play an important role in longevity of a human being. Protein This is the nutrient that gets the most hype. Go to any nutritionist and they'll suggest a lot of food items for the proper intake of protein. These include meat, eggs, and some grains. So why is protein so popular? Well, protein is the building block of your body. No, we don't mean just muscles. We're talking on a deeper level. Whether it's your bones, muscles, skin, hair, or even the cells in your body, Everything contains protein. In fact, protein is responsible for a staggering 16% of an average human's body weight. Even your hormones and antibodies are composed of proteins. In other words, it would be very difficult to live without this nutrient. This begs the question, what are proteins made of? Well, the answer is fairly simple. They're made up of different types of amino acids. Your body needs protein so that it can function properly. This is why your nutritionists always stress that you have a lot of protein in your diet, even if you're looking to lose weight. So the next time they ask you to have scrambled eggs at breakfast, take the advice. They only want what's good for you. Fats Yes, the nutrient that you want to avoid. Well, maybe you shouldn't avoid it so much after all. Of course, an excessive amount of fat may be dangerous for your body. Too much fat can cause problems for our blood pressure levels and heart as well as our digestive and respiratory systems. So why are we saying you shouldn't avoid fats? Well, according to a study at Harvard Medical School, it was found that fats help the absorption of other nutrients. On top of that, fats play an important role in cell building. If that wasn't enough to convince you, the study also showed that fats help to improve your muscle movement. While you might want to avoid fat because of high amounts of calories, it would be better if you ingest it and then burn those calories instead. Additionally, if you can consume fats at a controlled basis and burn calories, it will decrease the risk of heart diseases. More importantly, you'll have a lower chance of getting type 2 diabetes. It had also been speculated that controlled intake of fat improves brain function. Minerals When we talk about minerals for our body, 
the first thing that might come to mind is calcium. Although this isn't the only one, don't forget about iron and zinc. So, what does this terrific trio of calcium, iron, and zinc do for the body? Calcium is the mineral responsible for your strong bones. It helps to transmit nerve signals from one part of the body to the other. Calcium helps maintain healthy blood pressure, as well as improve muscle contraction and relaxation. Similarly, zinc is your go-to mineral when it comes to boosting your healing factor. Zinc improves your metabolism and strengthens your immune system. It also increases your resistance against diseases. The last mineral here is iron, which is responsible for the creation of your red blood cells. On top of that, iron also plays an important role in the production of hormones in your body. Carbohydrates While the world is moving towards low-carb diets, it's still one of the most important nutrients for our body. Carbohydrates serve as food for your brain and your central nervous system. While we wouldn't ruin your diet plan by including too many carbs, you should still consume a healthy amount of this nutrient in order to have a healthy lifestyle. Are you consuming your nutrients? Do you drink enough water every day? Let us know in the comments. We would love to hear from you. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait, what kind of Bestie would we be if we didn't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left, or write video and enjoy.